Greetings YouTube, it's Monday, March 14th. There's a couple things I want to show you today. Real-time magnetosphere simulation, look at this, it's all over the place. Just crazy stuff going on here with the magnetosphere. And the RSOE EDS website has a new layout now. You can scroll down and see events here. I don't know if I like it or not, it takes it forever to load now, but... There's six volcanoes erupting worldwide right now. And as you can see, we're littered with airplane incidents again. So let's have a look at the FAA and get a little more detail on it. Now this claims only six events. Oh, they haven't been updated yet. It's only the 11th, so wait for an update there. Here from ATS, I've got an article saying that Air Force WC-135 detects deadly radiation over Pacific U.S. in 24 hours. I've heard that a Navy crew had to be decontaminated. So this is real, folks. This is concerning, you know. This is... you got to pay attention to this. People are going to start getting sick if this is true. Government ain't saying shit about it. Pardon my language, but, you know. Space weather, we had a C-1 and C-4 flare. Geomagnetic activity has been quiet for storms, but... The magnetosphere, as I showed you, was all over the place. And there have been no more quakes around the fault line I was speaking of yesterday, so that's definitely a good thing. But I'm still monitoring it very closely. It's rather concerning. You can see aftershocks are continuing here. Still. 5.1. Stay tuned, people.